And hello again, Internet. Well, here we are on what should be the last day, day three of Quake 1, Mission Pack 2, Dis Disillusion of Eternity, had to think for a second there, which is the second part of the id expansion block two. It's a whole lot of twos in this one today, but not as many as it's going to be next time. Oh boy. Ugh. At any rate, a little late recording today for a reason. This is the day that Humble Bundle, Monthly Bundle, has rolled over to the next bundle. And oh boy, this next one's a doozy. I am grabbing this one pretty much as soon as I finish streaming. Because the hook titles are Tales of Basuria, Sniper Elite 4, and Staxel. And I'm sure I mispronounced at least one of those damn titles. So you've got a $50 roleplay game on the Tales series, which is re supposedly really, really good one. One that a friend of mine has highly recommended, so I am going to check that one out. <laughs> yeah, thanks very much, Z. Yeah, Twitch is a little late on that sometimes, but yeah, I'm definitely checking that one out. Sniper Elite 4, I find that one kind of funny because they just did um, a CI bundle, which had a bunch of sniper games in it, but not 4. And remember, this is $12 for the monthly one to get these three titles and a bunch more later if you want. Plus, on top of that, they went... Well, this month, if you've already got these titles, or you don't really want these titles, and you want something different for the hook title, you can choose th to get Rise of the Tomb Raider instead. So, hey, I mean, I'm going for the b hook titles that are there. Because, holy crap, that that's a great deal. I'm going for that. But they give you an option this month, even. So, kudos. I did go ahead and check out the other games that were added last month. Eh, not bad, not great. But it was still worth it just to get, like, Hat and Time and Conan Exiles and such. Yeah, absolutely. I totally approve of having the choice like that. More power to them. It would be great if they did that in the future. So, yeah, Humble Bundle. I do have links in my description. That's one of the reasons that I'm actually talking about it, because I do support Humble Bundle. I'd honestly do this anyway, but the fact that I have the links, that helps. It really does. It means that one of these days I'll be able to get a nice keyboard to go with my nice mouse. Yeah. At any rate, let's jump in the game. That and the more money I have, the better games I can do for this game, for this stuff. Mm. As if I don't have a giant backlog already. Alright, let's load it up, blood sacrifice. Make a quick save. That's not a quick save, but that's okay, because this is my day save. That's the quick save. Let's do it. Alright, there should only be three levels left at most. So, oh, nope, oh, oh. nope. Switch to the grenade. See, it's been a couple days and I've forgotten how to play Quake. That is not the one I wanted to use. Okay, you wish you could trade Sniper Elite for Tomb Raider? I kind of want Sniper Elite, to be entirely honest. That's one of the ones that I'm looking forward to, so I'm okay with that. I have no idea what the Staxel is. I'm sure it's something... Okay, there is a whining sound in this... Ow. There is a whining sound in this that could be something like a saw somewhere, or it could be a glitch. I have no idea. It's very annoying, whatever it is. Now, I did also pick up a game yesterday for a reason for streaming, but it's a PlayStation 2 game, and I'm now having problems. My video capture stopped working. In fact, it crashes OBS so hard. It's definitely something in the game. It crashes OBS so hard that I have to reboot to get it to stop. So that's unpleasant. But I can tell you what I picked up. I, I actually grabbed a copy of the PlayStation 2 Sega or Sonic Mega Collection Plus specifically so that I could actually have the other Game Gear games. I mean, I'm going to run... If, if I run them, they'll be emulated. But at least now I have them. And so the thing is, I can't do it until I can actually show them off that I have the legit copy. Which means until that works, those aren't going to be run on the stream anytime soon. I have no idea why it doesn't work right now. Ow, it happened after a Windows update. Because of course it did, why wouldn't it? Really? 
There you go. Splash damage got you finally. Yeah, there is some saw noise going on in this map. It is very annoying. But it is in the map, as you can hear. I get far enough away. It's not there anymore, so it's not a glitch. It's the game. I always hate that with some of the stuff. It's like, well, is it a glitch? Or is it the game doing it on purpose? I can't tell. That's what happens when you get noises like that. I need this... I need the silver key. Okay, I was going to say, that's like a, that's a broken door. What do I need the key for? I, got, I have... Okay. This is a wooden door. I have an axe. Why do I need the key? How come it took me this long to figure that one out, huh? Ah! Okay, then. <laughs> nice. I like that trap. I really do. Ah, don't like that. Don't like that at all. I'm glad there's no falling damage, because, boy, that would have sucked a lot. Hi there, Death Knight. Oh, Death Knight here. This guy right here just got added to Quake Champions. Yeah, he's one of the champions you can choose now. That guy. I thought that was an interesting choice, that now one of the enemies is one of the champions you can choose, but hey, why not? I have not tried him out yet. I should. Now that I actually have... Oh, God. Yep. Yep. That one out. Woo! Okay. That was a trap and a half. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Well, that was definitely an interesting room. Okay, you know what? I'll give him that. That was a good room. That was some Indiana Jones shit right there. And who doesn't love some good old-fashioned Indiana Jones? I mean, you know, one in three at least. Because we don't need Crystal the Skull shit. Nobody needs that. Ow! Ow. That's like a major hit there. I was going to say, I can just crouch under it. Oh, right. No crouch button in this. And I did also look up. The uh, company here, Rogue, is the one who did Strife. Which, you know, I do recommend Strife. It is a good game. It is available on Steam and GOG in the Veteran Edition, so it runs on modern systems. They did add some stuff to it as well, so that's not like it isn't the original version anymore. But that's okay. They added some secrets. I don't know if you can actually go back and go, no, I want the original. But it's at least available, which is something. And again, that's another one of the Night Dive Studios games that they brought back in... Oh, shit, no, no, no. Ah, well, I'm dead. Okay, so... That's not going to be fun. Because we got... Teleports in one of those spiders that you guys know I hate. Oh, well, I have lava nails. God, I would really could use some armor. I would really could use some armor. I speaketh much goodly. Alright, do I have any shotgun shells? I got 40 of them. That buzzing is very annoying. Hi there, Death Knight. Die already, please. Please. I would much like it if you would stop moving. Thank you. That one listened to me. Eventual... Okay. We got pushers. First one's always free. Hey, I pushed them. I pushed the pushers. And... You got an unhappiness. That is unhappy. Damn it. Okay, so that's about the blast radius of those grenades. Good to know, good to know.
now we have even more sound effects going on. This is a very loud map and I don't like it. Okay, now that's some bullshit right there. And dead. Yeah, that is some bullshit. Let's go ahead and switch to this to kill them faster. Or I could be out of that ammo and not be able to kill them faster. Well, that didn't go well. Hey, hey, there... Ooh. Okay, well, yeah, that buzzing sound was a buzzsaw up top there. Don't jump into it. Alright, let's switch to this. May not be as good as Lava Nails, but it'll do. It'll do. Oh, come back and play with me. I will lead your ass right back one to go. Lift is now active. Yay! This will be where the one is. Ah, don't you dare! Look at that! You tried to grenade me. Oh, wow! Nice! The same trap from the previous floor. Goes right up through the roof from the bars. I like that. I, uh, there's that same blade. Oh, that is awesome. Same trap. It's the same trap. It's just that now we're above it instead of below it. That's pretty cool. I approve. This map has actually been more entertaining than the previous maps had been. So, ow! Okay, I, you probably could have shot that one from a distance. But I didn't see it from the distance, so... Or maybe you have to get close enough for the mouth to open, I don't know. Oh, we got some infighting going on! That didn't last long. No cluster bomb, please. Alrighty, let's pick up the ammo because ammo is good. We like having ammo. We're going to keep shooting things. We need to keep having ammo. Hello. Ow. Ow! That was more of an owl than I was expecting. Alright. Super nails it is. Because again, ammo. Now you're going to get back up. Oh, that was a cluster bomb right behind me. Do not want, do not want. Is there? Nope. Oh, fuck it. Throwing traps behind you. Gotta hate that. Alrighty. But at least I heard that that was there. Is there a way up there that doesn't involve rocket jumping? Maybe. Do I care? Yeah, maybe. I've opened a secret area. It's got a teleporter. Maybe that's the way up. Whoops, that was the wrong button. So what happens when you hit F5? Hey, that was the way up. And I fell down. Let's try that again. Wow, I am good at this. I can walk across platforms. Litning. Now let's get the nails out. How many nails have I got? 200 super nails. 
With the quad damage. Let's do this shit. Razor blades on the floor. Where are they? Ow. I'm up here again. I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. That does nothing. Oh, okay. Well, the quad damage got me one enemy to kill. Yay, great timing on that. It's like, you should generally try to put those where somebody can use them. It's always frustrating to get a power-up like that, but by the time you find enemies to use it on, it, it, it's worn out. No, come get... Ow, motherfucker. There, how about you come get me? Come at me, bro. That was highly amusing. That was everything I could have wanted. There's one behind me, too. Something behind me. Yep. Oh, God, cluster bomb. Ow! Let's not bounce it around the cluster bombs. You know what? Let's just go in here for a bit. Get in there. Aw, oh, yeah. Wait, what? I heard another door open. Oh, hey. Oh, I actually took damage. Ow. Okay. It's on a platform. That's going to be bad. I still don't know what this is supposed to do. I literally have no idea what this is supposed to do, because... Sequence complete! That means I should have a... Yep. Let's go down here. Silver key opens that one door. Still not done with the traps. Whoa! Lava nails coming out of the lava. Fun. Ow, ow. Okay, that, yeah, no, I just hurt myself more than that. Boom, 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 boom. Ow. Yeah, let, let's stand right where the thing's going to hit me. That's a great idea. Eh, thank you very much, Z, and yes. Yes, it is a trap. Haha, <laughs> I've already been here. Alright. Oop, door's behind me. Please tell me that that's the end of this level. Because they could be a dick, and that's just part one. Now we've got to go get the gold key here in Pyramid 2. Oh, hello. That didn't work. Oh, it's a tarp. So it's a covering for my car. Gotcha. Shit, it's this guy again. Okay, his friends, not good either. At least they die faster. 
But yeah, that guy, that guy's not fun. But another dead dude. So, let's get out of here. Two more levels to go. Yay! I left two things alive. Don't care. We are almost out of here. Oh, god damn it. Ow, still got hit with it. Actually, using that one would be better because A, tighter spread, faster shots. Definitely want these more for the long range. Actually, you want the nail gun for the long range, but our choices are limited. All right. Oh, see, so yeah, and I missed. Acid? The hell? Oh, no, you got snakes down here. Okay. Okay, eels, whatever. I know it's not set. I keep pressing it because I keep forgetting this game doesn't have that button. Crow, hello. And up and out. No problem. Alright. We got saws again. Hey, doggos! I haven't seen doggos this expansion. More traps. Getting used to how they're doing things. But roar, where is it? Nope. It's, a <laughs> it's like it's not behind me. Look up, look up! I think it's dead. Doggos! Well, those dogs didn't do too well. That guy was smart! Halt! You know... Dude, shoot first, yell halt later. Alrighty. We are slowly working our way through. Okay. Upstairs time. Well, or just time for this, I guess. And now let's just try to hurry up a little bit. I still have no idea what this is supposed to do. Hi, swords! Oh, Jesus. Ow. That didn't actually hurt me that much. Okay. Ah, oh, the door closed! Anyone up there still? Nope, I guess I fell down the other side. Alright, well, that was successful. That was weird. I'm usually not that successful. Uh, hi there, how you doing? I'm usually not that efficient. I'm worried now. Very, very worried. Okay. Utter failure.
Notice how I'm using the default weapon a lot. Can I sneak that through those? Eh, not that way. Come on, aim better. Well, I hit something with it. I turned something into chunky salsa. Who said that? Oh, you did. It's like, wait. Who? What? Freeze? Where? Probably don't do as much damage when they don't cluster. I think hitting them with it directly doesn't do as much damage as if it had actually exploded nearby. Something tells me this is a trap. Huh, I guess I just had to open that somehow. Really, shoot first. Alright, well I'm still going to go explore some more. I'm, again, I'm liking the layout of this level. I really do. This has been a breath of fresh air as opposed to the previous day I played this. I was about to say yesterday, but it wasn't yesterday, it was a few days ago. I, I really do like the way this is laid out better. I happen to be rather enjoying this map. That doesn't look ominous at all! Ah, a, okay, that's a no shit. Ow, right in my face. I need that face. I like that face. Why am I even over on this side? What was the purpose of coming here? Okay, well, I guess that. Okay, first things first, find out where the hell those things are so I can shoot them. Alright, anything else down here? Any more? Any more? Not seeing him. This is not where I... Ooh, not where I expected to be. Ow, my armor. I used to have armor. I liked having armor. Having armor is useful. And they're shooting at me. The walls are shooting at me! One more to go. Walls are not very good shots. Let's get out of there when I sit. I've opened the door. The walls did not hit me at all. It's amazing. What's well, the secret to the timing? Run through them. I, I mean, you know. Not really hard. Okay, up, down. Freeze. Okay. Oh Jesus. Okay, that's 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 not what I wanted to see. Go away, please. Thank you. You are hurting me. That hurt. Did not like. I'm glad the sword's not trying to come down and get me. I guess the swords can't actually fly. They're ground based. They look like they're flying. But it looks like they're actually ground-based. Okay. Again, figuring out game mechanics by basically looking at bugs. Because it's kind of a bug. Or a workaround, whatever you want to call it. Ah!
that zombie was a little too close. What did that one hit? No, whatever. That one should be chunky salsa. More chunky salsa. Nope, that one didn't get chunky salsa. Now it did. Just casually going through here, the sewers. Looking for, well, things like this. In the obligatory sewer level. Huh! <laughs> surprise! Very much did not like that surprise. Didn't like that one either. Come up. No, come. Ah, there we go. Let's get out of here. Oopsie doodle. And another surprise. And a cluster bomb. So I'm glad I wasn't there when that went off. You've activated the bridge. How? I would like to know how I actually activated that. I really would. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad I did. Yeah, health, more exploration. Let's... I'm gonna have to explore more. I'm also out of regular grenades now. Which is not a situation I want to be in. But I do still have plenty of rockets, so I'm not too upset. I'll bet it's this side over here. Okay, well, let's go over here. Oh, I guess I'm not out of rockets. I must have accidentally scrolled. I mean, out of grenades. Yep, yep. Oh, I'm popping up at my feet. Don't like that. So. Nope, that's not the right way to go. Let's try this again without the stupid. No, if he did that, it wouldn't really be me now, would it? Okay, so here's the bridge. I went up on this side before, so I'm trying to figure out how to go up this side now, which is what I'm going to assume. Other side opens the other thing, which in this case will be the door. I'm not seeing it at all because I just did a loop around to here. That did not work. There's a possibility. Yeah, there's a place I haven't been yet. And would you look at that? An elevator. So, come down. Go up. How'd that work for you, dude? Standing in the closet this whole time, waiting for someone to show up, and you get boomed. That would be what I did. I pushed that on the other side. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Up we go. Switch weapons. Ooh, um, grenade, yes. Ow. Okay, go back down, 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 go back down. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, I just rained death upon myself. That didn't work. I got rockets with your name on it. I know it's hard to see them when they're coming at you that fast, but trust me, they had your name on them. What was his name again? Okay, that gives me this right here, which gives me a secret area. You've been through this before! No, I saw the switch up there. 
And I figured it'd be a secret. Ah, oh, no, 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 no! Let's actually hit him. That would help. There we go. Actually hitting the thing you're shooting toward, usually a good idea. It's amazing how frequently that works better than not hitting what you're aiming at. I mean, there are times, but they are not frequent. You know, it depends on certain weapons and such, and yada yada. Upsy doodle. Doggos! I'm kind of surprised they put dogs back in after what happened with Wolfenstein 3D. Okay, there's now a bridge somewhere that works. Okay. Ah, uh, took care of that problem. I still love that with Wolfenstein 3D. I have no idea what's up with this floor here. All right, I made a bridge, everybody! Building bridges. Ah bridge was a mistake. Bridge was a mistake. All right, bridge is not a mistake anymore. Okay. But yeah, I love that Wolfenstein 3D. You can kill all the people you want in the game because they were Nazis and they're bad people. But don't you dare kill the dogs. Why, that was a line too far. So once again, we have dogs in an id software game for you to shoot for no reason. Come on. I was hoping to kill you faster than that. Fortunately, its things don't seem to do that much damage, especially if you're armored. Still doesn't mean I want them. Oh, hey, that looks like it might be the exit. We might be approaching the last level. How many of those do you want in a single level? I mean, really, this is what, three now? Of those big shambler dudes? Okay, I need health. There's probably health back here. There is health back here. All right. Oh, that happened last level. All righty. What is this one called? The source of evil. And this really is it. This is the last level in all of Quake 1's official releases. You've already completed Quake 1. Now, I haven't done it on the stream, but... And I'm not going to, because if you want to play Quake 1, go play Quake 1. We've done the first expansion pack, and this is the last expansion pack they released. This is the last of official Quake. So where are you, mofo? Oh, you're a, you're a dragon. You're a dragon. Okay. And I have a low gravity ring. I could really use some health. Oh, I've got 117 health now. I'm just going to sit here and hit you with these basically BFG 9000 shots, which is kind of impressive because Quake 2 came out after this. And these, these shots here do act like, ow, like the BFG 9000. Let's shoot double rockets at it. Or triple rockets. That might be better. I kind of want to get up in there. Oh, quadruple rockets. Okay. Oh, there's only supposed to be multi, uh, triples, but I guess four rockets will work. Uh, assuming I can actually hit the dragon with them, and I got caught down in the lava. That's 
be nice and aggressive. This thing takes a ton of damage. Oh, that's what happened. I picked up a goddamn grenade launcher. Again, I wasn't actually out of the grenade, the ammo. It just switched weapons on me because I picked one up. Not even intentionally either. Like there, there it was. Again, not at all what I wanted to do. But the dragon is dead. The source of evil was a dragon. Not sure I care about that. Or care for that. Three, two, one. Missed one on this side. Sequence complete. There we go. So what was Quake the Dragon back there? Finally, Quake's temporal teleporter yields to your assault. And then I turn around and use it. Okay, fine. Destroy the teleporter, now go through the teleporter. This doesn't work. A high-pitched scream emits from the devastated device as stressed steel blasts outward to rock the cavern. The machine is devoured by molten lava. The ground shudders as reality shifts back to its predestined path. You run to the charged time pod, scrambling in as the chamber closes. Your consciousness fades as you realize you have halted Quake's plans for the dissolution of eternity. Dun dun dun! Yeah, the story sucks. Let's be honest. The story's kind of crap. But, yeah, in all honesty, how are you going to do a last boss that isn't disappointing? It's pretty hard to do. Final bosses are a very difficult thing. And, hey, you know, dragons are cool, so why not be a dragon? All right, fine. Whatever. It was a dragon. But it was nothing special. It's just a bullet sponge dragon. You sit there and shoot at it until it stops flying around. Congratulations. Alright, well that's that's it. There's Quake 2's second expansion pack. The last three levels. Uh, I suppose I should... I, I guess I can't actually get it to tell me the stats at the end. Probably you know one out of one and no secrets although there might be secrets and I don't even care if there are. Because it's done. It's Quake 1. And I do not like Quake 1. I don't like the enemies in it. I don't like the color palette. It looks so crap. This stuff just looks so... mushy to me. Everything... They had to go so low polygon because it's an early engine that it's difficult to tell what things are half the time. I don't like the fact that it kept switching my weapon on me. A G two, and I don't know if that's Quake two or Quake one proper, or if it's something in this expansion or something in this custom engine that I never found to turn off. But I don't like that. I want to use the fucking weapon I've chosen. This particular expansion had some good levels and some really bad levels. Um, the some of the enemies were nice. I mean, I, I liked the, I really did like the upgraded ammo. That's probably my favorite part of this expansion. That's kind of a sad statement to say that that is my favorite part of this expansion. But it that was cool. It gives you new options. Same weapon, different ammo. I, I especially like that. That it, it's not that I have to pick up a whole new weapon. No, no, it's the same weapon, but different ammo for it. I do appreciate that. Oh man, I don't like. Like those flying wraith enemies. The swords were cool. I liked the sword. I wish you could pick one up and use it at the as your own re replacement for the axe. Because that would be hilarious. But alas, it didn't let you do that. It just fell to the ground and you went, oh, I don't need a sword, I have an axe. Which you never use. Like, if you have an axe, why can't you burst through wooden doors? It makes no damn sense. Those 
Egyptian bosses. God, those things were bullet sponges. And then they... I don't know if they spawned the other ones or if the other ones just spawned around them. You could tell which one was which based on the color of their shots. The real one had the yellow shots, which did more damage. The other ones had the red shots. They were quick to kill. That was kind of neat, but again, a little too bullet spongy. The first boss, which was just... Uh, just Again, just this was just an enhanced version of their wraiths, which I didn't really like the wraiths that much because of the, you can't avoid their shots. They track you down. They go around corners. They'll, once it's fired, you're going to get hit. I don't like that at all. I'd really, and then that's again, something that's based on the core game. Those spider dudes have the same shots, except the spider ones do more damage. This expansion also failed in progression. That's one of my big bugaboos, is you're not making a series of maps. You're making episodes, and you have to think with the episode of what you get when in that episode. You don't, you don't throw everything at the player right away. They have to build up. They spend the, the game, the episode, building up. By about halfway through the episode, sure. Then they can have everything. But it's like even at the beginning of episode two, just here's everything on the first map. I, you don't have to do that. That's what I really liked about the uh, Doom one. Except the even then they did throw the weapons and stuff at you early. But at least that one, the map progression did actually progress. They were getting harder and harder and harder as you went along. I wouldn't say that the later levels of this were harder. And we only ever got the two elements! I don't remember picking up earth and water. We got air, we got fire, I remember those two. What happened to earth and water? It's like they had this idea and then dropped it. Maybe I missed them. Maybe we got those in the previous episode. I don't know. Because I just remember seeing earth and fire, or I mean air and fire. And then you had points like the placement of the quad damage, especially on the one map. Yeah, here's the last secret of the game, a quad damage sitting on top of the exit portal after you have killed every enemy in the map. That's not where you put quad damage. You can put armor up there, you can put health up there. You could put a weapon up there if you hadn't already given all the damn weapons away. But quad damage? <sighs> Thing is, this same company did what I'm playing next. Start Starting tomorrow, it's gonna be the second Quake 2 expansion. Also done by Rogue. So we'll see if they improved any. Till then, Internet. Again, check out the Humble Bundle Monthly Bundle. Great stuff on it right now. You've got... You can either choose Rise of the Tomb Raider or the real one, which is Tales of Basiria, Sniper Elite 4, and Staxel. Again, I may be mispronouncing one of those titles, or two of those titles. I think I got Sniper Elite 4. I think I pronounced that one right. Unless it's Sniper or something. <laughs> definitely, definitely gonna go check, gonna go grab that one. I'm grabbing that monthly pretty much right now because that's pretty awesome. Yo, Humble Bundle, yay! Check my links in the description. Other than that, yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. It's been a thing, but hey, now I can say that I've finished all of Quake 1 and never have to play the damn thing again. What about all the user maps? Fuck the user maps. I'm sure there's tons. Oh, I know. I know there's tons of mods out there for it. But unlike Doom, I'm having trouble with the special engines, and it's just not as fun. Doom is fun. Doom is all kinds of fun. Quake just isn't. See you guys tomorrow, Internet.
until then, take care and enjoy the games you play. When I push the buttons to stop streaming, you are supposed to stop streaming. Ah!